few minutes you'll see one or two of the things that the ties can be used to, used for to throw your opponent. The Breton uh, jacket is actually called a chemise more. It's a very tight fitting thing with a couple of ties each side and they tend to throw each other by catching hold of ties or catching hold a very tight round neck. So, if we now start with some of the more well-known holds, first of all, Jerry will demonstrate to you how normally a Cornish wrestler will gather up the jacket, and he will gather up the jacket, roll it up, and stick it under his arm. Now, that makes it very much more difficult to initially get hold of a jacket, bearing in mind and remembering that in order to throw your opponent, you've got to catch hold of the jacket and throw him by catching hold of that jacket. So, if we start off with one of the very well-known holds, we've got one called the four hip, and you'll notice here that the thrower, I'm not sure which one Jerry's doing the throw, he actually backs under his opponent and with one of his hips and pulls his opponent over the top. And there's a very similar one to that that's called the teddy bag heave. Now, if anybody can remember sacks of potatoes on the back of a lorry butt, uh, flat, flat one, you can see there that is very similar to pulling a sack of potatoes onto your back and then throwing it off afterwards when you're putting the potatoes into a pile. So, those are two where you actually get your hips under your opponent. And in Cornish wrestling, if you watch very much of it, you'll hear people say, people who are well versed in Cornish wrestling style, they will, you will hear them say, get in under your opponent, um, not sure what Jerry's going to do there for a minute. Oh, you're waiting for instructions, right. <laughs> so, after the, the four heap and the teddy bag heave, we'll do the strong men's throws. Take a good hold on the jacket. Pull your opponent forward onto your thigh and then rotate him around so that he falls flat on his back. The whole point about Cornish wrestling is to throw your opponent flat on his back. If you throw your opponent so that at least two, three of the pins simultaneously hit the ground, that would be called a back. And when I say the three pins, I mean the two, two shoulders and the two hips. So at least three pins hitting the ground simultaneously. So we've got four heave. Then we've got the under heave. And you'll notice here that Jerry ducks under Richard's arm, lifts him up and drops him down. And the back heave. 